Good morning. Idea. Please see me at my office. Yeah, come in. You sent for me, sir. Yes, I did. Um, how come you look more beautiful each time I see you? Well, maybe because my man takes very good care of me. Oh, yeah? Your man? Yeah. And who is this, your man? A very special man. Is he more special than I am? I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's always so funny when we do this. I know, right? Um, also, you need to stop calling me to your office for nothing. Otherwise, they'll start to suspect us. Suspect? Who cares? We're two adults in a relationship. Well, you are my boss. And so? <laughs> well, tell that to the CEO. All right, cool. On that note, I need to get going back to my desk. Okay? Not until you give me a kiss. Really? Yeah. Uh, Can I go now? Yes, you can. <laughs> Babe, really? I can just keep my hands to myself. <laughs> so what do we do? You're not serious. What well, work, okay? <laughs> See you later. Let's keep this here. Again. Come on, in, sir. Yes, sir. Carmen. Uh, come on, sir. I'm Morrison. Good morning. Sit down. Thank you. So, how far have you gone with the company check and everything? So, I did a background check on the company, and uh, it's a reputable one. Good. I believe we can partner with them on the project. Sure. Yes, sir. You're comfortable with them. Yes, sir. All right. So uh, we have to schedule a meeting okay. that we can now discuss and sign the documents and commence with the project immediately. That's it, yes, sir. But don't uh, schedule a meeting for Monday. My daughter is coming back by this weekend, and um, oh. Monday will be too hectic for me. Happy for you, sir. Thank you. That's good. Um, so would Tuesday be okay? Tuesday, yeah, perfect. Okay, perfect. great. Then. Mm -hmm. So I'll schedule a meeting for Tuesday. All right, um, I think we have other things to do. Yeah. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. Hmm. Baby, baby. Hello. You're killing me with a smell. What are you cooking? <laughs> well, your favorite. You can tell by the smell, I'm sure. It smells so good. Can't wait to have a bite. Mm. I just got off the phone with the partners. Okay. So, we're able to schedule a meeting for Tuesday. Tuesday? Why not Monday? CEO says his daughter is coming back from the States, so 
He's in the sports. Really? Yeah. Um, he also said um, she's coming back fully. More like she's returning to Nigeria now for good. Nice, nice. <laughs> Have you met her before? Nope. But I've chanced on a picture. Oh. She's cool. Okay. Cool, so, cool. So, can we get to the kitchen so I can have a small bite? Um, why don't you just relax? I mean, it'll be ready in a Wait bit. a minute. Take 10, 15. Too long. Let me just, <laughs> let me see if I can have a bite. Okay, come okay. through. Come on. You know what? I instructed the chair to prepare your favorite. Oh. So let's just go and Daddy, I just need to freshen up and eat. I am so famished. Yes, no. Thank you. Thank you, Uncle. Thank you. I am so hungry. Delicious, Dad. Mm. The chef is great. Mm. Too good. She is. She is. So, how is everybody? The company, everything? Yeah, you're all doing good. The company is doing great. In fact, we continue multiplying our profit on an annual basis. Every year, profit multiplies. So, you're doing fine. Mm. Thank God you're back. <laughs> and I believe. Have to pump in once in a while to see what we're doing. Of course, I will. That's good. <laughs> I will for sure. Hmm. Tomorrow, I'll make sure to get one of the native suits for you. I've missed that. Really missed so, that. when are you going to teach me about school, your life over there, your <laughs> aunties, your uncles and aunties, and uh, every other person? Yeah, there's nothing new to say. I basically gave you all the gist, so I'm not talking about Our school was good. Hmm. I miss a lot of my friends, you know. I know. Ah, guy. Alpha. Hey, mama. Alpha, no. Cool, but you didn't tell me you were coming. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't planning on coming either. Everything I good. had a meeting around, so... I decided to come and see you. you know? Started to pop in. Yes. Looking sharp, my guy. As always. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Hey. Hi, how are you? Baby, how are you doing? I'm all right. Yeah. Hi. Hi, Idia. How are you doing? Very well. How about you? I'm good, as you can see. <laughs> Fine. Nice. Um, maybe I'll just be upstairs. Sure, sure. You're looking beautiful anyway. Thank you. <laughs> Guy, what are you looking at? Guy, you both are sits together. <laughs> Why are you talking as if we started dating yesterday? We've been dating for like a year plus. <laughs> Wait, I want to get something here. Are you still seriously into this girl? Am I seeing someone that you know? See, guy. Why are you like this now? This girl like is not in your level. Come on. She's a junior staff in your company. So? You're not supposed to be dating this girl. Come on. <laughs> You're her boss. When it comes to true love, there's nothing like boss or levels, my guy. Not only do I like it, I love her. Love? Yes. Look, enough of this nonsense stuff. Let me get her something to drink, okay? 
Okay, if you I say know, so, I know Lover your Boy. <laughs> <laughs> I like the name Lover Boy, it works. <laughs> Crazy guy. Sir, so those are the documents we'll be presenting to them. You sure all the clauses are here? Yes, I did. Everything I say should include. Yes, sir. That's yes. good. This is. Hmm. This is good. So, what time are they coming? Um, in the next 30 minutes, we should start the meeting. 30 minutes. Yes, sir. I'm sure, we are ready for them. Must have. Yeah, come. Hi, Daddy. Oh, my angel. You're the most beautiful girl in the world. <laughs> Daddy. Your beauty, you remind me a lot about your mother. Oh, yes, you. oh, sorry. Um, <laughs> this is my daughter, Beauty. Beauty, this is Maurice, uh, the head of management in this company. Nice to meet you. Same here. So, Vicky, what are you doing here? Daddy, you forgot to leave the ATM card out. Oh, my word. <laughs> well, uh, not completely my fault. I rushed out. I know, that's why I'm here. Uh, uh, which bank will you be comfortable with? Um, let me see. <laughs> mm, okay, use this. Thank you. Thank you. Same pin, right? Same pin. Okay, Daddy. Hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, so I'll just leave you to get back to work and do your thing. Be careful. I have a wonderful day. I will. Mm. I will, Papa. Thank you. Bye, Morris. Bye. That's my lovely daughter. <laughs> so, sir, I, I'll go prep for the meeting. Yes, please. Uh, make sure everything is ready. Yeah? Sure, sir. And call me once they're here. Okay, sir. Mm -hmm. All right, sir. Let me just go through. Okay, no problem, sir. I'm going to prep. Ah, beauty. Just please come sit down and watch with me. You will enjoy it. Uh, what is this about? This is a very beautiful program. You know, animals and human beings have some similarities. Just watch and you will see them. Okay. Let's yeah, see them. <laughs> yeah, um... Dad, uh -huh. what's the name of your staff I met at your office the other day? Staff? Oh, that's Morris. <laughs> True, <laughs> I totally forgot his name. Hmm. He seems like a nice guy. Oh, yes, he is. He is. He's excellent in his work and trustworthy. Hmm. Trust me, yeah, he is. <laughs> oh, good to know. <laughs> I bet he's an amazing husband and father too. Uh, Morris? Husband? No, 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 he's not married. He isn't married? No, he's not. But I don't know if he has a kid, but if he has, he'll have discussed with me. Okay. Beauty, <laughs> where <laughs> 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 Oh my goodness. You see, can you put him? Can I see the fight? Watch it. You just watch an animals fight. Yeah. <laughs> oh my word. Okay, it seems interesting though. Very interesting. <laughs>
Hi. Hi. <laughs> do you remember me? Yeah, I do. I met you at my dad's office some days ago. Good, good. Yeah, I, I was just driving around and I saw you standing by a car. <sighs> Is everything okay? It's not okay, actually. I, I was on my way back from the gym and it just started jerking at it. I don't know what to do. Oh, jerking? Yes. Let, me, let me see. From the look of things, I think it's something that a mechanic needs to check. Oh, um, let me just call my dad. No, 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 there'll be no need. Um, I, I know of a mechanic who's close by. Let me just pick my phone from the car and... Uh-huh. Yeah, Mustafa. I need you to come to number 11. We are around the Ademola Crescent Street. Yeah, my friend's car is broken down. I need you to help her. Yes, yes, yes. You see us by the roadside. Okay. Come with your tools, huh? Come with your tools. Please, be snappy. All right, all right. So... Thank you so much. No problem, no problem. The mechanic will be here soon. Okay. You can go, I'll just wait. No, here. I'll stick around. It's no problem. I mean, I can't have my CEO's daughter standing by the roadside. Sit in the car, okay? Please. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You can sit down. Thank just sit down, okay? I'll watch your car. Hey, come in. Hi. Hey. Um, please have a seat. <laughs> I'm actually in a hurry. I came to see my dad and I decided to stop by to say hi. Oh, that's quite thoughtful of you. <laughs> Thank you. And the car, was he able to fix the car properly? Uh, and, um... <laughs> he did. Oh, Thank you so much. You're welcome. Um, I I couldn't call you because I didn't have your number and I couldn't ask you that. You can actually get my number. Oh, sure. Mm -hmm. Just give me your phone and I'll impute my number. <sighs> Thank you. Hi. Thanks. So I'll, I'll save it then. Mm. Uh, I'll, I'll just leave it to work, okay? Sure. Good to see you again. Same here. See you soon. All right, sure. Bye. days now and he still hasn't called me. That's strange. And I don't have his number. I could have called him myself. No, he should be the one calling me. Definitely my spec. I need to do something. Come 
I'm coming. Hi. Hey. I came to see a dad. Uh, okay. Uh, he's upstairs. Uh, please have a seat. Ah, thank you. I'll go call him. Sure, you. sure. Thank you. He'll be with you shortly. Okay, thank you. Yeah, um, do you need anything? Water, drink? I can actually have the cold No, no, I'm okay. Thank you, appreciate it. You sure? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. I, I was wondering why I didn't hear from you again. Oh, snap. Look, I'm, I'm, I'm really, I'm sorry. I, I got very busy. I'm so sorry. Hmm. Busy? Too busy to check on me or see if the car is in good condition? Look, I... I'm really, I'm sorry. I, I don't know what <laughs> It's fine. Doing. I was just pulling your legs. Well, I can tell you're a good guy. Yeah, from the way you're just apologizing. You're not even trying to defend or justify yourself. Just me. <laughs> I like that. Thank you. Can we be friends? Yeah, sure. Okay. I know. Yeah. Call me. Most definitely. Oh, my dad is coming. Okay. And I'm getting you a drink. Uh, okay. You're our guest. Can't refuse. All right. You think she likes you? Well, um, she gave me a number and um, she said I should call her. Then she insisted we get close. So, mm. uh, you know, one thing with these abroad people is that they are usually very straightforward. Mm -hmm. If they like you, they'll come out straight up and tell you. Exactly. Mm. So, what do you do now? Do, do nothing. My what do you mean, do nothing? I have a girlfriend, so I don't need to pursue her. Which girlfriend? Morris. Wait, don't tell me that you want to allow this opportunity to pass you by. What opportunity? Morris. Are you not seeing what God is doing for you? What is God doing? Your boss's daughter likes you. The only child that he has. The heir to everything he owns. You'll be a fool if you don't take up this opportunity and pursue that girl for real. But I love Idia. I love her. My whole heart. Which Idia? Bro, Idia is just a junior staff at the company where Beauty's father is the owner. Right? Come yeah. on, man. You need me to rephrase that she's the only child of this man. And she, in fact, she controls everything. If you get married to that girl, you'll be in possession of the man's riches. What makes you think you will end up in marriage? As long as you play your cards well. I'm sure it will. Look, I'm not interested in playing any cards. I love Idia and, and that's it. I'm not, bro, I'm not interested. See, who is talking about love here? Love is not important, okay? Besides, by the time you start staying with beauty, you get to love her and you forget about that idiot girl. No, no, don't, don't say that idiot girl. Don't say that, bro. Okay, sorry about that. But listen, bro, you don't need to miss out on this opportunity. You need to give your relationship with beauty a chance. Let it work. Okay? Bro, this is jackpot. You need to grab it. Bye. 
I talking to someone? You've made your point. I mean, so what are you going to do? Well, I'll do nothing now. Because I, I love Idi. I wish you were my shoes. Maurice, stop talking about love. This girl has money. She has potential. And that's the problem. Such girls will end up controlling your entire life. Forget about control. Enter there first. Uh -uh. What is that? You're looking at money and you're, you're, you're just complaining. my boss. And so? Why would I want to play such games? Even your boss knows that you're a very intelligent man. He would want to hand his daughter over to you. And it's a win-win for you. All right? I love you, dear. Guy, yeah, if I was in your shoes, man, I would just grab this opportunity and I would run with it. I won't even... Uh, let's just see shoes then. <laughs> you crazy. <laughs> <laughs> my God. You want my shoes? Enter. You know I did. Are you not seeing what God is doing for you? What is God doing? Your boss's daughter likes you. The only child that he has, the heir to everything he owns. You'll be a fool if you don't take up this opportunity and pursue that girl for real. Out! Oh, sorry. So sorry. So sorry. So, uh, is, the, is it that painful? Yeah. It's actually worse than the pain I had there before. I'm so sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let me massage it again, well. Um, it's okay. Thank you. I don't want you destroying my legs. No, of course I'm not going to destroy your legs. You're beautiful legs. Come on. I'll be gentle this time. Okay? Sure. How do you like it now? More like it. Okay. Please just be careful. I will. Please don't sleep, okay? <laughs> <laughs> More like it. Okay, mommy. This oh, hi. You finally called. Wow, today must be a special day then. I guess it is. How are you doing? I'm very fine, thank you. Um, so, I was... I was thinking we could hang out one of these days, if that's okay by you. <laughs> I would like that. Great. Fantastic. Um... Can we, can we do dinner tomorrow? Dinner is okay. All right then. So we're on for tomorrow. Yeah. Good. All right. Have a good one. Okay. Bye. Bye. So, is it right to say this is a date? Yes, it is. Yes. No, I meant it is. Okay. Um, is it also right to say you're single? Of course, of course, of course I'm single. <laughs> okay. But I find that hard to believe. Am I so? I mean, you're handsome and quite successful. The truth, thanks for the compliments, but I'm saying there's no one. Mm. Enjoying your food? Of course I am. You look elegant. 
That was just by the way. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> this is really nice. Yeah, Enjoy the cool day. Place. Sure. I love the ambience. Mm -hmm. Quiet. Serene. Me too. It makes you ponder about a lot of things, yeah. A lot of things like what? I go into church and pray. <laughs> I will leave, okay? Let me drop you. I'll Please. find my way. My dad is no home. You can go and come back some other time. I know your dad is not around. I came to see you instead. Why do you want to see me? I got this for you. Thanks. You're welcome. Look, um, I'm sorry, I, I know I shouldn't have behaved the way I did, um, I'm sorry, okay, I just, I just don't want us to rush things. It's fine, I understand, you can leave. I said I'm sorry. And I said you should leave. Well, if you don't want to leave, I'll have to leave you here instead. <laughs> My guy with the two wives. <laughs> Can't stop that. You don't enjoy you. It's too wise. You know it's not easy dating two girls. Mm. I want to break up with one of them, sir. Mm. I think that's the right thing to do. No, I mean, I to. you suppose for, my, you suppose for my sanity. For your sanity. Mm -hmm. And I know who you're supposed to break up with. You know now. See, you have to break up with Idia so you can have more time for beauty. So if you marry her sharp sharp. No, we two don't wait for me. This guy, you know well. Uh, why do you think I'll break up with India? Because, bro, beauty is better off. Guy, we don't talk this thing before now, eh? See, beauty is your ticket to generational wealth. This guy, and you know it. This guy, what generational wealth? Money. See, we are guys. Let me tell you this. I'm, 
Beauty, she's okay. But the thing is, I love Idia. I've tried so hard to connect with Beauty. It's not working. Whenever I'm with Idia and myself, I'm cool. But whenever I'm with Beauty, it's like I'm someone else. I'm, I feel guilty. It's like I'm pretending to be who I'm not. And the thing is, as a guy, see, I could feel knock Idia like 10 rounds. Beauty, as soon as I do one, I know you get that vibe, you know? What is who is talking about Naki? Wait till your own game. Bro, we're talking about money. What do you mean by wait your own game? Money. This girl has they money. Pay me now. I Think about the money. Me. Forget about the knack. Do I you want, understand? I want true love. To Idia. To beauty. <laughs> <laughs> now you know. <laughs> <laughs> Think your phone is ringing. <laughs> hmm. Ah, speak of the devil. Hello, baby. Okay. All right, cool. So you can come to my place tomorrow, then we talk. Okay? Bye bye, baby. What did she say? She said we need to talk something. Urgent? About? She didn't say. Oh, well, there's no problem, Sha. Me too. Okay. Ah, so, like I said, cheers to beauty, man. <laughs> cheers to idiot. <laughs> Do you know what are you? Hey, babes. How you doing? You okay? Was good. Um, you said there's something you want to tell me. Yes. Um, I don't know how to say it or how you react to it. What's going on? You don't. How I'm going to react to it? I don't understand. I. I What's wrong? I. You're making me nervous. What is it? What if I could just, just go ahead and say it? I mean, say it. What's I'm pregnant. It? Wow. I, I, I know it's it's been barely two months we met and it feels rushed, but I don't know. I just, I found out and I've been panicking. <laughs> Well, if you're not ready to be a father, I can get rid of the pregnancy. Uh, I'm just scared. I don't know how my father is going to take the information. I, I don't know what to do. I'm so scared and I'm sorry, okay? I don't know what to do. I'm just scared. I, I don't know what to do. It's okay. It's okay. I'm sorry. It's okay. Don't worry. Sounded so urgent. What happened? Yes, bro. Wala deal. Wala. Yes, so big one. What's it happen? Beauty is pregnant. Are you serious? I don't could take something like that play now. Now you know. Uh, we don't say now you know. Uh, you're responsible, bro. <laughs> Congratulations. What, Come are you, on. What, are you, what are you congratulating me for? Uh, why won't I? You're about to be a father. Look, you don't understand. 
I'm not ready to be a father now. I can't be a father now. Let me tell you, it's not about what you want right now. Beauty is pregnant and you have to accept it. That's it. What about Idia? Oh, come on. What about her? Huh? Isn't it obvious that the two of you are not meant to be together? Listen, you need to let that girl go and focus on beauty and your born child. It's not as easy as you make it sound. Oh. Guy, Maurice, nothing they had for this thing now. Eh? All you need to do is just let this other girl go and start thinking of how to get married to beauty. That's it. Listen, start thinking of how to propose to her as soon as possible. Come on, it's good news. Stop making your face as if somebody died, Jerry. What about you, dear? I don't know how See, he is going to cope. Boris, there is no how, okay? Just forget about that Ida girl. She doesn't even suit you. Stop saying that. Stop saying that. I'm saying it. Beauty is on board right now, okay? She's pregnant for you. I, come on, I man. I still love Idia. Forget about Idia. Please. Hey, cheer up. We need to celebrate. Oh. All this while you're making faces as if maybe something happened. It's not easy like that. It's not easy, man. Guy, give me a hand. You didn't shoot. Give me a hand. <laughs> you're laughing. You think it's funny. Man. It's not funny. It's good news, bro. I'm happy but for I'm you. I'm not ready. Damn. Yeah, not you ready. Should. No, you should be ready right now. <laughs> I'm good. I'm only worried about you, dear. There's nothing to worry about, okay? Beauty is on board right now. So just My love, I leave. Forget about that girl. It's going to be difficult. Babe, so that was how I helped that woman. You know, like... <laughs> I'm pregnant. All you need to do is just... Let this other girl go and start thinking of how to get married to beauty. That's it. You need to let that girl go and focus on beauty and your own child. Start thinking of how to propose to her as soon as possible. Come on, it's good news. Babe, can you hear me? Babe. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah, are you, yeah, are yeah. you sure you were listening to me? No, I was. Yes, I was. Are you sure you were listening to me? Yes, so was. Good. So what was the last thing I said? Uh, I was listening to you and I was thinking about work at the same time. Work? Yeah, baby. What about work? Is, is everything okay? Everything is fine. Like, I'm just a bit worried about the new contract we got the other day, you see? It requires a lot of attention and... It's kind of huge. I don't want to mess up. That's not a problem, okay? I know you're going to kill it, as always. Thank you. Yeah. Welcome. <laughs> yes. Yeah? No matter what happens, I always love you, okay? I love you too. Ah, <sighs> Daddy, he'll be here soon. Beauty, who is this person you want me to meet? Oh, Daddy, can you just be patient, please? Okay. You'll see him soon. I think he's here. I'll be right back. She's so excited. <laughs> I'm coming. Hi. 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 Okay. Yes, I. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, Morris. The person you wanted to meet. Yes, Daddy. Sit down. Thank you. Thank you, sir. <clears throat> um, 
Sir, I... I know this might sound a bit weird, but I'm... I'm in love with your daughter. And I... I sincerely love her with my whole heart. She's the missing piece I've been searching for all this while. As soon as I met her, I knew she was the one. I... That is why I've got the courage to come and see you to seek your consent to marry your daughter. To marry her? Yes, sir. Is it not too sudden? No, Dad, it's not sudden. No, sir, I... We... We love each other so much. Yes, sir. When the love is real, I... I don't see why we should wait. <sighs> well, good point for two of you. Who am I to object when you have decided to make the bold step? And um, all I have to do as a father is give you both my blessings. Thank you, sir. Thank you, <laughs> Thank sir. you daddy. Thank you. It's Morris. Yes, sir. You have to promise me that you take proper care of my daughter. <laughs> yes, sir. On my life. This is all I have. Oh, Daddy. Yeah. <laughs> thank you so much, Dad. Yes, Dad, thank you. Get him something to drink. Okay, I'll get you something to drink. Champagne, <laughs> good. Thank you, sir. Oh, oh my God. You are now my son. Thank you, sir. That's good. Um, Morris. I have any word. Take good care of her. Yes, sir. That okay? Yes, sir. Love it. All right. Awaiting. So now you are my son in law. Yes, sir. All right. <laughs> All right. Cheers to the future son in law of. Chief Magnus. <laughs> Cheers, bro. You're so lucky, man. Are we? Yes, now. <sighs> what? She doesn't deserve this. Um, who? Idia. Oh, Idia again. Yeah, I forget about this babe now. She's in your past now. Get it? <sighs> she doesn't know anything now. That's the sad part. To her, we're still together. Okay, then you should tell her so she can move on. Right? That would be too cruel, bro. Then not telling her will be better? Is that what you think? I just don't want to hurt her to her face. <sighs> Listen, whether you hurt her in her face or behind her, it makes no difference to me. But then, if you decide not to tell her, then it's fine. Come on, man. Cheer up, man. We're celebrating you. Huh? Cheers, bro. <laughs> mm. And you know, as your best man. <laughs> Life is not fair. Life is fair when there's money. <laughs> Yeah, babe. Hey, what's good? I spoke with the event planner and she said she'll be available on second of next month. Second of next month? That's like um that's like three weeks from now. Yep. Isn't that sudden? Sudden? <laughs> of course it's not. Have you forgotten I'm pregnant? 
And I really wouldn't want to look you to my wedding day. Okay, but uh... Um, well, no buts, okay? Please. I don't want people to see me in that condition on my special day. Besides, I would I want people to do much with a big tummy. Well, it's fine if if you still insist on us speaking another date, then it's fine. No, 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 there'll, there'll be no need for that. She said second or next month, right? Yeah, that's cool. Are you sure? Yeah. Are you sure? Very sure. Oh, thank you. Let's do this, baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Sure. You told me you did not want. Why? Mm -hmm. <laughs> now I want. Fun time sweet. <laughs> oh my goodness, you are serious. Mm -hmm. But three weeks from now, I need to start learning how yeah, to I dance. I need to even call the baker and everything because I have so much to do. Just take it easy, huh? Yeah. Come in. Baby. Hey, baby. How are you? Hey, How? hey, hey, baby. We come doing this in the office, okay? Anybody could just walk in on us. Um. Well, you were the one who didn't care. Yeah, but I care now. How you? How you doing? <laughs> okay. I'm. Um, I'm sorry. Ah, oh, that's alright. That's fine. Um. Do we still get to see later today? No, I kind of busy. Busy? Yes, please. I'm, I'm busy with work, you know. That's the same thing you've been telling me for God knows how long. Is there something I need to know about? Nothing. So why have you been avoiding me? How am I avoiding you? Do you know? Look, it looks like you up for a fight. I'm not really in the mood, okay? Before you got here, I was working. Oh, work? And now I'm working, yeah. Okay. Do you do something else other than what I know that you do here? Look, I'm not in the mood for a fight, okay? You can see I'm working, so you go back to your legs and uh, we'll talk later. Wait. Are you... Are you asking me? Out of your office? If that's how you say it, I won't be grudgy. Cool. I right, so. Just me or this CEO's daughter seems to be coming to the office quite often these days. And, and it's like she's always going to Mr. Morris's office. Don't tell me you don't know. Know what? She and Mr. Morris, they are getting married too. Married? I don't, I don't understand. Idea, you don't know. That means you don't know. I hear from a reliable source that they are getting married. In a few weeks' time. Wait, are you are you sure of what you're saying? Idea, they are getting married. It's real.
Why are you standing up? I'll be right back. What are you going to? What is she going to do in his office? I'm so sorry. Sorry. Is that a work that's brought into your office? I'm sorry, it looks like she missed the way. Better be. <laughs> I can't add anything to it. Hmm? Not really. You want to give me something to eat? You are not tea, no. Jesus Christ. What are you doing here? Waiting for you. I'm sure you were with her. Why did you tell me you were getting married to her? Answer me. I don't know. I'm sorry. Really? So you weren't going to tell me then? She's only been back for what? Three months. And you two are already dating? <laughs> I don't understand. When did you two start dating? Shortly after she she got back to Nigeria. Sincerely, I I didn't plan any of this to happen. I'm sorry. What was your plan then? Look, Answer I me. I didn't mean to hurt you. I'm sorry. Yet you did. I thought you said you loved me. I still do. I... I love you. You love me? You're marrying my mother. Is that what love means to you? Look, I'm... I'm sorry. Stop saying you're sorry because you're not. I, I truly am. I'm sorry. Anyway, I would accept this apology. This, if you call off this thing you have with her. I'm sorry, I, I can't. Why can't you? I'm sorry. been together for over a year and we love each other at least that's what you tell me all the time what changed was it because her father is our boss why is that something you're not telling me 
Mars, I love you, and you love me. Please, please don't let go of us. Just, just, just call off this thing, this, this wedding with her, and then we can move on together. Please. Why can't you? Why can't you, Morris? Because. Because she's kind of my baby. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry, okay. Please. Sorry. Get your filthy hands off me. You're a heartless person. You got her pregnant. And you were even going to marry her. Without telling me. What was your plan? What, was, what, what exactly was your plan? Marry her and still be with me? I'm sorry. Babes. I promise you, you will regret what you did to me. God will punish you. God will judge you. You would end up sad and very lonely. I hate you. I swear, I hate you so much. Cry my baby. I'm sorry. Love 
What is this? Eh? What is this? What? How many times will I tell this man? Eh? Start from the bottom. Simple instruction. You will not listen. You will hear from me today. Morris! 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 Where is he? Morris! Morris, what is this? How many, how many times will I teach you how to use a toothpaste? Did you just hit me with that? Why wouldn't I hit you? Tell me. How many times will I teach you how to use a freaking toothpaste? Are you that slow? I'm sorry. This sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. That is all I hear from you every day. You are sorry. You know, I just can't imagine. Are you, are you, are you, are you dumb or something? Excuse me? You're quite excused. Yes, you are quite excused. <sighs> Let this be the last time I will warn you on this. Have I made myself clear? Rubbish. Yeah, come in. Good morning, sir. Here are the documents for the project. All necessary adjustments have been made. I would be my office. You dear. You don't have to call me, sir. Are you really okay? Idiot. I'm fine. Anyways, I have sent the documents to your email. I hope you have time to look at it. Yeah, I'll check it now.
can you see I'm working? Mm, you can do that later. Why are you why are you like that? I want you. Look, I I need to work. I'm sorry. But I want you. So can't this wait for later? No, we can't. We're not supposed to be having sex under this condition. Wait, am, am I complaining to you? Oh, baby, look. I'm not in the mood for sex. Besides, your condition doesn't permit it. I don't understand. Are you the one pregnant? I am the one pregnant and I told you I'm fine. And I'm telling you I'm trying to work. And I said I want you. Let's do this some other time. No, we are doing it tonight. I'm still wasting time. What is all this? Please keep this. Yeah, I'm going downstairs. Morris! Morris, Morris, you... Morris! Is it that bad, being married to her? Guy, guy, it's, it's hell. <clears throat> she's not the same person again. She nags, she's annoying, she's controlling. I'm tired. <sighs> wow. Maybe it's because of the pregnancy. You know, I hear that pregnant women usually have mood swings. Maybe that's why she's behaving like that. No, bro. <clears throat> no. She's not the same person I married. Yes, I know pregnant women have mood swings sometimes. Mm -hmm. It's unbearable. But this one, she has the same mood every time. It's so unbearable. <laughs> What's funny? I'm so sorry. Bro. Oh, really? You're laughing? <laughs> no, you didn't have to see your face. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I I miss her. Tara. Yeah. I miss her so much. Who? Idia. Idia? Yeah. Bro, what makes it worse is whenever I see her at the workplace. I know she must hate me so much. Do you think she still loves you? I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't have gotten involved with beauty in the first place. No, it, was, it was a big mistake. No, though. it wasn't any mistake. I promise you that you made the right decision. Okay? I guarantee you that. Don't say it again. I don't think so. I am saying... That is your best decision. Though it might not look like you right now, but in the long run, things will begin to normalize. I know that you miss Idia and you don't enjoy marrying beauty. But then, just calm down. Everything will come back to, to normal. All right? Considering the fact that you and beauty did not even date for a while before getting married. So it's normal. And then, Maybe after the baby, everything will come back to normal. And you begin to enjoy your marriage. All right? So let's just attach everything that is going on right now to the pregnancy. So by the time she gives birth to your daughter or to your son, then everything is back and you have a full family. Okay? Trust me. You think so? Of course. I know so. Come on. Drink up, bro. Sure. Yeah. Drink. It's okay, I'm just. Okay. Good afternoon, sir. Sit down. Thank you, sir. <clears throat> 
Morris. Yes, sir. I sent for you. Now listen to me and listen very carefully. My late wife and I married for so many years without a child. Suddenly a miracle happened and she became pregnant with beauty. After she gave birth, she died. Unfortunately. Oh, I'm so sorry, sir. I raised beauty all by myself. So I love her with everything in me. She's the only one I have in this world, the only legacy I have. When she came to me and said she loved you and wanted to marry you, well, I didn't uh, ask so much questions, even when I have my doubts, because I trust her and I trust her decisions. But please, don't make me regret that now. Don't. Yes, sir. Beauty came here crying that you are my treating her in the house. Why? <sighs> sir, that's not true. Beauty has never lied to me. Not at all. And she cannot start now because she is your wife. Young man, whatever is the problem in your family, in your house, Please fix it. Yes, sir. Did you hear me? Yes, sir. Fix it. Yes, sir. I know you have some jobs to do in the office. Yes, sir. Leave. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. What did you tell your dad? Hmm? What did you tell your dad? Is that why you're screaming my name like that? Is that not enough reason for me to scream your name? You weren't telling your dad I don't treat you right. Mm -hmm. Are you? Is it that you're ungrateful? What do you mean by I don't treat you right? I cook breakfast for you every morning. I clean the house. I do the house chores. Is that not treating you right? What else do you want me to do? Perform your manly duties. That's all. Oh. Okay. So to you, it's all about the sex. Mm. See, because I refused the sex the other day due to your condition, you went crying to your daddy like a baby. Look, I know you love sex that much. Don't you ever your life talk to me that manner again. Are you mad? Get away from my front. Here. Oh, right. I'm back, back, back. Ah, Idia, aren't you doing it? Um, I am. I just need to finish with this document. Workaholic. <laughs> you can do that tomorrow. Oh, yeah, but there's a lot to do tomorrow. So I'd rather finish with this ones and then do those ones tomorrow. Anyways, we're going now. Take care. Bye. 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 All right, girls. Bye. <laughs> Thank you. 
Anybody there? Is there still anyone in this office? Hi. Hi. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Um, stuff fell and just trying to pick it up. Oh, okay. I didn't even know you were still in here. Yeah, me too. I, I had some work to do. What about you? Are you still around? Same. I had some work to do as well. Okay. Yeah, but I'm done with all the work and I'll be heading home. All right, good night. Idia. Please don't wear it. Um, so, how are you doing? Uh, how have you been? Fine. I miss you. I... Each time I see you around, I... I get the reminder of how stupid I was to let you go. I still love you. Stop it. Don't say I, that. I do. You don't. I still do love you on my own my life. I do love you. You love me? Yes, I do. And you're married to another? That was a mistake. And the baby she's carrying. Look, Morris, do you understand how hard it is to wake up every day? come to work only to see my ex my ex who hurt me so bad and the worst part is I I still love you yes I still love you but nothing can ever happen between us our story is done it's over <gasps> Morris, don't ever do that to me again. I will never let you toy with my feelings again. Never. I'm sorry. Stop it. Don't say that. You don't. Morris. Don't ever do that to me again. I will never let you toy with my feelings again. Never.
Ilian. I am so sorry. I am so sorry this is happening. Babes, take heart, okay? I believe you'll get something better out there. I'm sorry. I mean, you don't deserve this. You put in so much of work into this organization. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Ilian. Take care, okay? What happened? Why? Why is she carrying the She was fired, sir. Fired? Yes, sir. Fired for what? Okay, is there HR in the office? Yes, sir. Okay, thank you. Come, come. Good morning, sir. Ah, Morris, good morning. Sir, so if you will indulge me, there's something I want to discuss with you. What is it? So I saw one of the junior staff leave and uh, she had all her terms. Upon inquiry, she said she's been fired based on the instruction. Is it true, sir? Yes, it's true. Sir, so please, um, now I know the reason why. Go home and ask your wife. So please, I, I don't understand. Your wife will make you understand. Okay, sir. And Morris. Yes, sir. Do you still have some work in the office? Yes, sir. Please go and do it. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I prepared dinner. Yours is on the dining. My legs are not paining me. You can talk. A junior staff of the office was fired today and uh, I'm told you requested for her to be fired. May I know the reason why? Hmm. Mm. Okay, um, she was fired because she is your mistress. My mistress? Yes, your mistress, and you dare not lie to me. She's, she's, she's not my mistress. Will you shut up? Shut it! Well, I'm not surprised. Is it not you? Cheap liar. You think you can fool me? Well, I saw you two at your office yesterday. Mm hmm? Cat got your tongue now. You cannot defend yourself. I not only saw you. I overheard your conversation. And look, I really don't care if 
you two had an affair or had something a situation before we met but what i will not take from you is trying to rekindle that stupid romance you had with that girl you hear me and she is so lucky she should count herself lucky that i am in this condition and i only fired her if not i would have dealt with her and as for you morris morris take your time oh. take your time take your time take your time don't say i did not warn you take your time you don't want to see the other side of me take your time a word is enough for the wise. <sighs> Nothing. I, I, I don't know. They just fired me. I promise you, I didn't do anything wrong. Nothing, I'm, I'm one of the best staff. I do my job perfectly well. Hold on, someone's at the door. Hold on, someone's at the door. Come in! Let me call you back. Hey. You were fired because of me. What? Yes. Maybe I shouldn't have spoken to you that day in my office. Yet you did. I was the one who got fired, not you. I'm sorry. Stop saying you're sorry. Aren't you tired of being sorry? Every time you say you're sorry and then you just go ahead and inflict more pain on me. Morris, what did I, what did I ever do to deserve such from you? I'll get you a new job and um, before the night, I'll sort your bills out. Do okay. I look like I want a new job? But I need to. Look, I, I love my old job. I know. So much. And I, I know. definitely need your money. Listen, at least let me do this, okay? I know you. Yeah, you know nothing, okay? Leave my house this minute. I do, I do not want to hear one more word from you. Just go. Leave. I... Just go! Cool. Cool. Yeah, I should go. Leave. This minute, Morris. Where are you coming from? Hey, I had some stuff to take care of. What stuffs? Is it that you interrogated me? I told you I had stuffs to do at the office. So you were with her, right? With who? That thing you've been messing around with. I don't understand. Please, don't try it. Don't try to play dumb with me because you and I know what and what I'm talking about. So firing her was not enough to reset her brain, right? Oh. To be honest with you, I... 
I haven't seen her since you fired her. Ah, Maurice. Maurice, 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 Maurice. You must think I am a stupid child you can tell lies to and I will believe you. Where are you coming from? Answer me. I can tell you're in the mood for a fight. I'm not interested. You, you must... Interested. Maurice, wait! Don't you that I am not done to... Maurice! Maurice! Oh. 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 Ah! Maurice! Ah! Oh. Oh. Ah! Maurice! What? Maurice! What is it? Oh. What? What? I think the baby's coming. Baby's oh. coming. Yes. Baby's coming. Baby's coming. Yes. Okay. Okay. Can you get up? Yes. So do, I, do I need to carry you? I don't carry me, don't carry me, let's go to the office too. Okay. Where are you coming from? Let me, let me get the car key. Can you move, please? I can move. Sorry, ah. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Ah. Oh my god. Easy. Oh my god. Easy, easy, easy. If easy. you were here, if you were here, oh. Oh, I'm so this wouldn't have happened. I'm here, I'm here. Don't touch me without your filthy hands. The hands you've used in touching that dead sick girl. Let me, let me go get the car keys, okay? Ah. Sorry, sorry. Oh. Um, how are they? I, the doctor hasn't said anything yet. I believe everything is under control. Hey, oh, doctor, how is she doing? Uh, my daughter? Yeah, it's a baby girl. Oh, wow. Yeah. Congratulations. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. Congrats to me. Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Nice. Can we see sure, sure, sure. Okay, please. Wow. I have a beautiful daughter. <laughs> My daughter is such an interesting character. I'd love for you to meet her. Meet her? Yeah. Hey, let me guess. How are you going to introduce me to her? Hi, child. Meet my side chick. <laughs> Come on, just say that. Come on. Just say that. Okay, so I'm going to introduce her as the as daddy's best friend. Mm. Yeah. I'm not kidding you, but um, you are the only woman I've ever loved. Um, mm. I know I know not things are a bit awkward between us now, but um, just indulge me and give me some time. I'll make things right, okay? I love you. I know. I love you too. <sighs> so cold near the start of it. It's beautiful. Okay, it might be important. Uh, yeah, hello? What? What's wrong? Okay, okay. Where? Bye. Okay, bye. What's wrong? Um, my daughter. She, she's been rushed to the hospital. She has crisis. Crisis? Yes, yeah, sorry. I see you have to go now. Okay, please just call me when you get sure, there. Sure. Okay, and give me the updates. Yeah, I will. Crisis. Hey, how's our daughter? The doctor is still examining her. Is everything okay? I don't know. She. What, what happened? She was crying repeatedly, and I noticed her mouth and body turned yellow. Wow. Oh. And she was in so much pain, so I just had to bring her to the hospital. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Everything will be fine. Okay. Just, just come down. Just relax. She'll be fine. Is it? Look, oh, is she okay? Yeah, she's stable now. Oh, good. Yeah, that's good. Um, 
What really happened to her? Well, we conducted some tests already, but we're still doing more. I would like to speak to you in my office if you don't mind doing Sure. Yeah. Okay, this way. So, um, from the test carried out, we discovered that your daughter has sickle cell anemia. What? How? No, 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 that's not possible. I am AA, so there's no way my daughter will be SS. No. Yeah, that's true. I'm AS, but with his AA, there is no way we're having sickle cell no, children. No, there's no way we're doing that. Okay, okay that's true. Um, when did you carry out this test and how sure are you with the test results? I did it many years ago. And um, I did a test at a very reputable hospital, so I'm very certain. And you? I've always known it since I was a kid. <clears throat> okay, it's best we do a new genotype for you both and your daughter, so we ascertain the real genotype. Is that okay? Sure, I'm, I'm up for it, no problem. Okay, okay. okay. so yeah. please follow me. Do you mind telling me why the test result says her daughter is not mine? Talk! I'll talk. Is she my daughter? I'll talk. Is she my daughter? I'll talk. You will talk? I'll talk. Okay. I'll talk. I'm listening. Talk. Is she my daughter? She's not your daughter. Maurice, I am sorry. I swear, I did not plan any of this. I didn't know I was pregnant when I got back from the States. It was until I carried out some tests that I found out why I did not know how to tell you. I did not know how to. I'm sorry. I'm serious. Don't touch me. Please, just. Please. Where is she? She's still your daughter. She's still your daughter, please. Please. Maurice. Maurice, please. Maurice. Maurice, please, I beg you. Maurice, please, I love you. I love you, okay? Please. Please, I'm scared of losing you. Please. Maurice! 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 Maurice, please! Maurice! What do I do? What do I do? Jesus Christ, what do I do? Hey. What's wrong? Why are you looking like this? Hey. What's going on? Hey. You know, whatever it is, you know you can tell me, right? I would always find a solution together. Scary me now. Tell me what. My princess. What is it? You are crying. What is this? What is the problem? Beauty, what is it? <laughs> Beauty! How are you feeling now? 
good, I guess. Maurice, I'm, I'm really sorry for everything. I'm sorry that I, I convinced you to marry yeah. that girl. No, no, Maybe stop. all this wouldn't have happened. Stop saying that. I, I made a decision. Okay? So stop blaming yourself. It's not your fault. I made a decision and... Yeah, it is what it is. And I did convince you to marry her. Look, you convinced me or whatever. I should have been firm. I should have sticked to my old relationship with Edia, but... But then I was No, just... no, no. It's, look. This marriage was a mistake from the very beginning. So, what are you going to do now? I'm going to divorce her. That's what I'm going to do. She's such an evil person. When was the last time you saw her? A week ago. After she confessed everything to me. She's been calling my phone repeatedly, but I chose not to pick. I can't just deal with her. You know, just take all the time you need. Okay? I sure will. And um, as it stands right now, I... I'll just have to continue working at the office until I find a new job. Okay. But once again, I am really sorry for everything. Look, it's okay, it's okay. Stop, stop patronizing, it's okay. I, I made a choice. In life, you are too responsible. Okay. Can we at least drink something? Yeah. Don't you think you need this? Not in the mood, bro. <sighs> Morris. Yes, sir. I know what my daughter did is bad and unjustifiable. But I also believe she didn't know that the child wasn't yours at first. But when she did, she still didn't tell me. Oh, yes, because she was afraid of losing you. You mean immediately you find out and you walk away. I said, I love you so deeply. Please, I want to beg of you, my son. Find a place in your heart to forgive her. I don't know what that. <sighs> Sir, I, I hold you in high esteem. That's why I've sat here all this long. What your daughter did is evil. It's rather unfortunate that I have made a decision. There's no turning back. I'm going to file for a divorce very soon. And I just pray she accepts my decision and move on. Sir, please. If this is the only reason why you called me, please. I'll have to leave. Thank you, sir. Have a good day. Is that what he said? Yes, my daughter. He doesn't want the marriage anymore. And he was very firm about his decision. Nothing can stop him. And I tried. You have to move on with your life. But you still love him. I know. But he doesn't love you anymore. No. Daddy, I cannot move on. But you have to It is me. Maurice I want. Hmm. Beauty, I have to be honest with you. He doesn't want you anymore. No. And I believe, and I'm very, very sure that Somebody else will come for you to love you and your daughter. No! No! It is Maurice I want and no one else. If I cannot have him, no one else will. Beauty. Beauty. Be very careful. Don't hurt yourself. 
Don't hurt yourself. Strong with beauty. She sounded somehow. Well, that's her business. Let me smile. Beauty driving off. She must be up to something. Let me find out. Oh, baby. Oh, boy. Baby, baby, I'm gone. I'm coming. Hurry up, please. Hurry up. Uh. So early, I mean, um, you have to make your breakfast. No, 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 uh, it has to pass. I uh, really have to be at the office like now. Okay. I understand. All right. Cheers. Mm -hmm. All right, break a leg. Bye. Bye, my love. You forgot something? Mm. What are you doing? Exactly what I should have done a long time ago. Okay. okay. You know what? Please. Don't do something you would regret, okay? You know, you, you have a child. You have a child to take care Shut of. Shut up! If one thing is certain, it is that I would never regret killing you. So you thought you could take my man and I would let you leave? But he was, he was never yours. But who is he still married to? Well, not for long. Shut up, you slut! He 
You are such a shameless bitch. He was with you and he left you for me, but you went back and continued warming his bed. How shameless can you be? Killing me will help you get him back? No, he won't. But I'm certain you two cannot be together. Because if I cannot have him, you can definitely not have him. Is this how desperate and foolish you are? So you go to jail. So what? He moves on to the next available woman. And your child, she will be all alone. Okay, by herself. Your precious, little, gorgeous, beautiful child will be by herself. Does that sound like a good plan? Do you think I care? I don't. And you know why? Who would know I killed you? No one. By the time Maurice gets back from work, you would have bled to death. And all fingers will be pointing at you. <laughs> Where is the evidence? There is no evidence. And you know my father, he has connections everywhere. I can get out easily. Mm. You know that? You <laughs> see, you had it all planned out, yeah. didn't you? <laughs> Impressive. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I am so smart, I know. I know. But I am done talking. Now say your last prayer. Girl, you know, you know you can still change your mind, right? Like you still have you still have some time. You can still change your mind. Do I look like I want to? <laughs> You have 10 seconds to pray. You don't have to do this. If you move an inch, I will blow your head off. Beauty. Don't shoot, don't shoot, please, I beg you. Drop the gun. Please. Not like your daughter, sir. You evil and despicable human being. After all you put her through, you still got the nerves to come here and want to kill her. reason why I won't call the police is because I respect and love you, sir. Please, make sure your daughter never repeats this nonsense again. I promise you will never. I'll get out of here. Please, leave! One more thing. I quit. I 
can no longer work for you. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so Now, when your daughter grows up and they tell her that her mother went to jail because of a man that never loved her or wanted her, what do you think she will tell her to her mates? Beauty, you're a disgrace to move after <laughs> I'm sorry, Daddy, I'm so sorry. I, I, I don't know what came over me. Well, I promise it won't happen again. Oh, sure. I promise oh, you. Oh, sure. You are very sorry it will never happen again because you are leaving this country first thing tomorrow morning with your daughter to wherever. And I promise you, you are no more wanted in this no. house. You are not welcome to this house again. Go up and pack your things and leave. Daddy, please. I'm I just please. said go up and pack your things and leave. Daddy, I don't want to go, Daddy, Let please. Me. Daddy, please. <laughs> This year has really been a tough one. For me, getting married to Beauty, to a suspect, you know, a baby that turned out to be a scum. To her almost killing you, to me quitting my job and starting all over again. It's really been a tough one. I'm sorry for hurting you. I'm, I'm sorry for putting you through all of this. But in all of this, I, I learned a bitter lesson, which is to be content. I saw a prospect in getting married to beauty. But I forgot to acknowledge the fact that God had already blessed me with something very special. And that special someone is you. I don't know what I would do without you. Thank you for sticking with me. I know apologies won't cut it. I, I can begin to apologize now and I apologize forever because it is what it is. But I'm. Lydia. Will you marry me? She says. Yes. <laughs> How many babies are we gonna have? Two. Two. Make it four. Oh my god. <laughs> that's two oops babies. So two twins, that's, that's four. <laughs> so we gotta be having it in the morning and the afternoon. Having what? Making the babies. <laughs> Cheers to making more babies. Cheers to making two babies. So two twins. <laughs> <laughs>
Pedro 